Thank you. Oh, oh damn it. Ah, you stupid asshole. In a world where shadows fall, and the light of a bonfire is your only salvation, one chosen undead will rise above the rest and claim his rightful title. Welcome to the legend of Scrubnub. Oh, what's cracking in the tip, everybody? It's your boy, King Leviathan. And we're back with another episode of the legend of Scrubnub. And today... We're going to go on a little bit of a soul harvest. As I require many numerous amounts of souls, not only to level up myself, but also to level up my armor. For I am the mightiest, but I must become even mightier if I am to undergo the task that is ahead of me. So let the slaughter begin. Wait, what? Invade world of Grave Lord Servant? No, thank you. Become the harbinger of death of An Orlando. Also, this is a free chest. From this point forward, I'm just going to talk normally because I can just do some little editing magic. I will sound horrifying. And it'll be fantastic. But for now, Everything must die. You know, I could always go back to the main gates. But what would be the fun in that? You will not get me! Your soul is mine. I didn't want that. This is for all the pain and agony that you've caused me, and all the souls that you've caused me to lose. This is on your head. Not mine. I'm going to slaughter every single one of you. And it will all be for my benefit. Nice try. But Lord Scrubnub does not go down that easily. And I don't want to hear it from anybody else otherwise. Checked back here. Shit. I don't see any souls to satiate my thirst or my hunger. This is not an illusory wall. This is bullshit, is what this is. Yet I hate it anyways. You know. It just occurred to me that I don't necessarily have enough of what I would need. Maybe? I don't know. 
I don't think I will down. Oh, there you are. You weren't there before. Your soul is mine. So I'm going to head down this way now. To see what we can see. Don't believe I've been down here before as the door is stop. Oh, hello. Caught me off guard there, son of a bitch. Which one of you wants me first? You do. Your mistake. None of you are going to survive. None of you. Drain every last soul out of you possible. I can't tell this mimic, so I'm just gonna hit it. Mimic, it is not. Demon Titan, that is completely useless to me. Where is this lead? Oh! Shortcut. You're going to die as well. And there's nothing you can do about it. going to attack every single body that is in this place. Except for the Titanic. That's just suicide. Well... Wait. Dudes were in here before, right? Around the corner? Yeah. Yeah. You're dead now. You know, this isn't going to be very entertaining to listen to for my voice, so I'm probably just going to put some music to this because it's more entertaining that way. Um, doing pretty good on Souls so far. I do need to locate that blacksmith. I'm pretty sure I heard. I'm pretty sure I'm going the completely wrong direction. Or not. To my right, death. To my left, more death. I already killed them. That's right. I need to go on this way. This is the way that I require to go. You gotta die. Because you're going to cause so many problems. Oh, dilly dally now, or your head will be chopped off. Okay. I 
require my armor to be reinforced. What do you require? Twinkling Titanite? You need Twinkling Titanite? Oh man. I don't remember where to get Twinkling Titanite. I apparently had two pieces of it. I think those were the Crystal Lizards, which if that's the case, I'm gonna have to do some off-camera work. Uh, there's only one of you though, right? There's another one of you. But guess what? You're not going to survive. Now are you? No, you're not. No. Do I have... I have the covetous gold ring. I do not have the covetous silver ring. So that's probably something I'm going to have to get. This is basically just a farming episode. So as I stated before, I'm probably just going to put music over it. And you won't really listen to me. I probably should have just done this off camera, but I think for one episode it should hurt. Tight neck chunk that's currently completely useless to me. Like, I need a lot of souls. Blocking my exit is rude. You can still hit me through that, that, that figures. Alright, do that again. Do that again. Do it again. Come on. Do it again. How come you only do it when I breathe fire, jackass? It's because I attacked. Is that why? I don't know if I did any damage, but I heard that. <laughs> You're in the way, bud. I need you to move. And I need you to stop doing that, too. fire reset and then go in and kill everything that I can. This dude can't even hit him with my flame breath. And every time I try that, he just does that. So I can't hit it. In my frickin' way. You got him kidding. Move. 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 Thank you. Jackass, aren't you? This, 
this is gonna be the whole episode? Seriously? I can get you to move like that, but then you're just an asshole afterwards. Alright, I'll be back for you guys. You guys are just assholes. You know what? I've got half a mind to pick a fight with the, uh, the other big bulky guys. Back at the, around the main bonfire. If I can go, I can go straight through the door at any point in time, so honestly I could just explore everywhere. I can go anywhere I want. I can hold off from fighting the next boss until I'm completely ready. And I could just do a montage. A, a training montage. You know what? Maybe that's what I'll do. I'll just record a bunch of footage and create a giant training montage that'll take forever to edit but it'll still be I think it would be pretty cool so maybe I'll do that instead that way um well that way it's more entertaining I don't really have to talk and put music to it, and it'll be shorter. I mean, it'll still it'll still probably fit within a half hour episode, but I can cut down footage. I don't know why I'm bothering to talk at this point. I'm just talking to myself, but Begin the training montage. Fifteen hundred souls, though. Faster. Seriously. Oh my gosh. strength. Ah, that stupid recoil. Ow. These guys make this really difficult. Like that. I cannot see. Blindness equals death. Really tough. 
tough enemies that need to be faced in the future. Sometimes you can catch these guys on the side, but it's not easy to do, and I can really only dodge that attack by jump dodging until I do that, and then I get too close. What the hell are you doing? I think I figured out the trick. Right with this guy. One sip and one down. That is progress. Hey, one sip, two down. There we go. There we go.
stand up and an idiot will cost you your life. That's what I thought. How did that not count? Giant shield. You, you, that's not a great shield, right? That's just a normal shield. No, not toggle status. 36 strength to wield. It doesn't say great shield. So guess what? Get the fuck out of my life. Oh. Just to see where I'm at. 16,275. Ugh. But I just need three more points. There's gotta be some easier way to do this.
happened there. Basically, starting off with that shield slam guarantees you death. That does it. That's it. That's a wrap. We did it. The final point. The final point shall be spent. The new form of Lord Scrubnub shall emerge post haste. There it is. one hand the dragon great sword but I can also use Havel's great shield we're in business now boys and with this the training montage has concluded and I will see you lords and ladies in the next exciting episode of the legend of Scrub Nub. Fare thee well. Tally ho! I am Lord Scrub Nub, I am the mightiest, and you are not. So please get out of my life, you stupid waste of space. You are not mightier than I. So get your filthy, disgusting face out of mine. Leave me be, you filthy beast. I want nothing of your time. I want nothing of your rhymes. I want nothing of your life. So put your ambitions away. For I am done with your shit. And I'm not going to take any more of it. 
this is the ballad of Lord Scrub Nub.